Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. First thing is first, make sure you like, subscribe, comment down below, and welcome to House of C. My name is Cassidy and today I have a fun, different little video for you. I am actually going to go over the wedding dresses that I tried on and did not pick. So I'm going to show you the images here or here. I'll put them up and I'll just go through it what my thought process was, why I didn't go with them. Uh, but yeah, it should be fun. So let's get into it. Okay, so disclaimer, the first dress that I tried on ended up being the one that I went with, which is crazy. But I had this specific image and idea of what I wanted in a dress. And they were able to find it for me. They really only had one dress that, that had it the specific thing, I don't want to give it away. I will have wedding footage up for you guys later on this year. Once I do get married, I'd say look for that in like June, July, August. Um, so yes, not to give details away, but the first picture that I have here is this white, just very plain structured white dress. It has this V, um, neckline that comes down pretty far. So what you probably are not seeing is that it has this overskirt on top of it with these pearl detailings all over. This was stunning. It was beautiful, but it just felt very simple to me. Like I wanted everything but the kitchen sink when it came to my wedding dress. I wanted all the drama. So this one just felt very, very simple. Um, it was beautiful though. Also, please do keep in mind that I tried on dresses about over a year and a half ago. So these are old pictures. Also, I've probably dropped about 15 pounds since then. So you'll see, I kind of have a bit of a tummy in these photos, but, um, but yeah, just to give you a little background of when this was. So yeah, I mean, it's beautiful. It's simple. It just wasn't me and what I was going for, but nonetheless, a gorgeous dress. Also, I went to Love Bridal, which is off South Broadway here in Denver. And then the other store that I went to was Platinum Bridal. You won't see any of the dresses I tried on there. Um, they were great, but none of, they did not have one single dress that had the element that I absolutely had to have. They were all beautiful dresses, but they were not what I was going for. There was one that I was like, yeah, this is decent. But again, I had to have the one thing, which you will see that my dress has. So just to give you again the backstory as to how this all went down. So that is the first dress. Moving on to the second one here. Okay, so this second dress was definitely like my second favorite dress. The only thing is that it didn't have the one thing that I was going for. Again, I don't want to say it because it'll give it away when it comes to my dress, um, but it's gorgeous. I don't know if you can tell, but it has this soft like blush kind of color underneath, but I mean, it was stunning. It fit so well, of course, because they clamped it. You can see it in the back. But I definitely could tell that my mother and my mother-in-law and my fiance's aunt loved this dress. I mean, it's just, it, it really was stunning. But again, I'd already tried on my dress that I ended up going with. And it just, it wasn't it. I just knew it wasn't the one, but it was definitely a runner-up for sure. A very close second. All right, moving on to the third dress. Okay, so I've got my laptop here with all the pictures on it. So if you see me going like this, I'm looking at the dress. So for this dress, it just didn't fit me well in all the, all the places. And again, it just didn't have this element that I was looking for. It was fine. I mean... I don't know what I also want to hear what you guys think. 
when it comes to one, two, three, and four, you're gonna see four different dresses, which ones you liked, which ones you didn't like, whether you thought I should have gone with the second one or not, but you'll have to make that decision once you see the dress that I picked. But yeah, it just, I don't know. I didn't like the lacy element of it either. It's just, it wasn't me. It just wasn't me. And again, it just really makes me look like I have a belly here. Like you can see that it just doesn't fit me well. And I'm sure that if they had tailored it to this and that, it would have looked much better, but she was not it. All right, moving on to the fourth dress here. This dress is really stunning. I will say that. Um, again, doesn't have all the drama that I'm looking for when it came to my wedding dress, but she just hugs me nicely. It has this beautiful beaded detailing throughout. I, I just, I think it's absolutely gorgeous. I love the way it fits me on top and even on the bottom, but it just doesn't have the drama that I want. So that's why I really didn't go with this dress, but again, very, very beautiful. So, so stunning. So yeah, I mean, that is really it guys. When it comes to the dresses that I tried on, I did not try on a lot, literally one day of shopping. I went to two different places and I found the one and it was the very first one that I tried on. And I just, I love it. And I can't wait. I have my first alteration in about a month. So I'll get to see what it looks like after they started making alterations. So I'll get to try it on and then we kind of play with it here and there. But I'm so excited to put it back on and see it. It's been so long. It's been almost a year that I dropped it off. I'm, I love it. I love it. I can't wait for you all to see it. But let me know down in the comments if you want to see more wedding content. I can definitely take some more, go through the process, kind of show you what it is that we're wanting to go for as for the feel, the colors, the theme, um, some of the different vendors that we're having there. We definitely have some uh, unique vendors and things that we'll have at our wedding that I really haven't seen at any other wedding or weddings that I've been to, but it's not like I've been to a ton. And I'm also used to like Midwest weddings, which they're different from, you know, a Colorado wedding or a California wedding or you know, even an East Coast wedding. So yeah, let me know if you guys want to see more wedding content. Also, let me know down below which one was your favorite dress, which was your least favorite dress. I really love getting your feedback and hearing your opinions. And last but not least, like I said, make sure that you subscribe here and make sure to watch a video right here. So I will see you all on the next one. Bye guys.